Hey guys! You all know that I usually don't destroy iPhones, especially brand new ones. They're one of the few pieces of tech I buy every year to, get this, use. But something felt different this time. What the hell? Why won't iPhone cable work with iPhone? That's because we are responsible for disfiguring your precious hole. Ah! There's been a breach in the ecosystem! Oh. How could Apple do this to me? <laughs> and that's when I realized you don't have to upgrade iPhones every year. What a crazy concept! And to prove my theory correct, I'm gonna be filming this entire video on my iPhone 14 Pro! Just like last year, except that was before it became obsolete. But I would rather use obsolescence than have my hole disfigured. I know this has been requested a lot, so for the first time ever, welcome to Board Smashing iPhone 15 Pro. Probably the first time a tech destruction channel has ever considered doing anything like this. Road, because he did something I don't think oh, I've ever seen. No! What's the point of being a YouTuber if you can't come up with any original ideas and no one recognizes you for your hard work? <laughs> Wait. Tim Cook? CEO of Apple Inc. acknowledged tech YouTubers like me? I feel seen and inspired to come up with an idea no other tech YouTuber has thought of before. Hmm. Durability test. Thanks, Tim Cook. You're welcome. Now buy more iPhones. I also bought the bigger version, so this video will be complete. What a sucker. In Tim Cook we trust. Go, go, go. <laughs> Not TikTok offensive. First original durability test, the Ben test. Now for this, we're not testing which phone is stronger, but to see if I'm stronger than Jerry Rig everything. He wasn't able to break a 15 Pro, but showed the 15 Pro Max who's boss. Will I get similar results? Who's more of a man? Let's find out. Gloves for safety. 15 Pro first. Three. Two, one. Ugh. Okay, we can conclude I'm just as strong as him so far. Now the Pro Max. Three, two, one. Mm. No, I can't believe it. I'll never be a real tech destruction YouTuber! Not just because I couldn't break a 15 Pro Max with my bare hands, but because this was the only original durability test I could come up with. <sighs> Maybe I should just return them. They're still in perfect condition anyway. Or maybe I should do what all YouTubers do. Steal! I mean, take inspiration from someone else! How else have people violated these phones? What? Someone made a music video with it? This I gotta see. One, two, three. I don't know, I got them good. I got them really good. I'm inspired! Let's make a music video with the iPhone 15 Pro just like how they did. By breaking things. She's lucky I don't sue. And we can see which one of these is tougher by the end. Thanks, Taylor Swift Light! Three, two, one, action! <gasps> First up, I'm gonna take inspiration from the flying dinnerware scene, except I want the dinnerware to fly directly at the viewer. Let's see which iPhone can get this shot. 15 Pro. Three, two, one, action! Ooh, 
things are starting off not well with the back glass cracked in multiple places and one of the camera lenses slightly cracked, but everything on the front still appears to be working fine. 15 Pro Max! Action! Action! Three, two, one, action! Back glass also cracked, but not as severely, and also all the camera lenses are still fine, and everything on the front works fine too. So I have to give the first scene to the 15 Pro Max. <laughs> Second up, I'm gonna copy the knife throwing scene, except I want the knives to fly directly at the viewer. Yeah, for safety and skill reasons, I'm just gonna drop these big knives on the phone directly. 15 Pro, three, Two, one. Ugh. Yeah, I was a little bit off and it resulted in me not getting the shot. <laughs> what? Oh, wait. Oh, it's still working. I thought I pierced the battery. I thought I was going to have another Microsoft Surface Duo situation. <laughs> There he is! I doubt the video saved though, like shut off immediately. Whoa! Wow! I think it saved. The video did save, but it's kind of glitched and didn't capture the part I wanted it to catch. It goes right there and then, oh, what the hell? But as you can see, video still works, so it's good for more scenes! Let's go! What is the anatomy of this thing where I didn't hit the battery somehow? Okay, I know this is lame and unfair, but I just want the shot. I really don't want another Microsoft Surface Duo situation. 15 Pro Max. Three, two, one, If you take a look right here, I think the knife landed between the titanium and the glass and just scratched both. And of course, it's still 100% working. So yeah, that's a million times better. Since it got special treatment and my aim was a bit off, I think it deserves another take. Action. Damn it. Action. Damn it. That's why I had the box there. Action. Action. 15 Pro Max, take two, three, two, one, action. Okay, I think I got enough shots of knives flying at the camera. Yeah, I think they put better magnets in the Pro Max that divert the knife away from the more sensitive parts of the phone. Either that or it's a skill issue. I know there are a lot of factors in that round that affect durability, but putting that aside, it's all about getting the shot, and the Pro Max did that fine. So I gotta give the point to the Pro Max. I know, I know, a lot of factors, a lot of factors. Results may vary. Third up, I'm gonna take the lamp throwing scene, except I want the lamp to fly closer to the viewer. And this is just in case if he tries anything funny. 15 Pro. 3, 2, 1, action. Well, that did not go how I thought it would. And it stopped recording. Hopefully it captured it. The cameras received more damage and slightly caved in, but they still work and we kinda got the shot. Can the 15 Pro Max save the shot again? 15 Pro Max. Three, two, one, action. Well, that went the same way, except I think the lamp is unbroken, but the Pro Max, yeah, it's the opposite of the Pro. It's protruding now. And it's still recording! Yes, we got the shot! Sometimes getting the shot requires some sacrifices, and this was definitely worth the sacrifice. Yeah! 
I got usable footage out of both of them, and both of them received an equal amount of damage, so I'm gonna have to call this scene a tie. <laughs> Looking at the Pro Max before this scene, it actually received way more damage. But it didn't stop recording in the middle of being hit by a lamp, so I'm still gonna call it a draw. Yeah, I know. But the reward is that they get to record me finishing this lamp off. Let there be no light! Damn. Now... Who wants to help me take a time lapse of all my 14 Pro charges? Thank God for lightning. Stop bickering. You both can help out. Sweet, 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 Break time's over. Back to work. Fourth up. I'm gonna steal the going through car window scene, except I'm just gonna throw the phones through them and completely ignore that warning message. But you, the viewer, shouldn't. Alright, I'm back in the junkyard looking for partially broken car windows, just like in the music video, and to be honest, it's a lot harder than I thought. Here's one. 15 Pro. Three, two, one. Oh, glass everywhere, look what you caused. But you're still recording, so we're good. Honestly, I can't really tell if it received more damage or not. Now for the 15 Pro Max. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, who fared worse? Well, looks like the phone fared better. Yeah, once again, I can't tell if it received any more damage or not, but like I've been saying, it doesn't matter as long as we got the shot, which we did! Yeah! So it's another tie! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I don't know why they warned us not to attempt it, because those were some of the coolest shots we got. Apple wants all the good shots to themselves! The music video is almost done! It just needs one final touch. More seeds of shit being thrown at the viewer! Now, who or what else can I steal inspiration from? This recording? Editor, don't put this in! How about apples to reference the camera being used? Yeah! Honestly, it's because we have an apple tree and we don't know what to do with all of them. Except to copy how to basic. 15 Pro! 3, 2, 1, action! Did it handle the juice? Uh-oh. Oh, wait, no, it did! Yes! Action! Mmm! Not bad! 15 Pro Max! 3, 2, 1, action! Come on, hope your own company didn't kill you! Yes! Action! Mmm! Ah! I cut my tongue! I cut my tongue! Uh, but still, not bad! Looks like both of them survived the 15 apples I threw at them. Yes, it was another reference to the cameras being used. He should be happy that we were able to capture the product placement shots, so they both deserve another draw. Let's take a look at a piece of Apple history. This is the PowerBook G4 Titanium. Apple's first titanium product from 2001. Check out the video where I successfully used it for a week. Such a fascinating piece of innovation. 15 Pro, 3, 2, 1, action! Did it survive the ancestor? Yes! Kinda, but we still got the footage! What? I wanted to make it more clear what camera was used to film this and the material it's made out of. 
I just realized that this is my first original idea in this video. Yeah! No one else can waste money like I can! Screen itself took a tiny bit of damage right there, but I'll kiss it and make it better. <laughs> 15 Pro Max! 3, 2, 1, action! Come on, don't get beat by obsolete tech. Yes, you survived the obsolescence. Perfectly fine. Just like the time I'm filming this. Yes, a coincidence, no! Since this screen got a tiny little boo-boo and it wouldn't go away after I kissed it, I'm gonna have to give this round to the 15 Pro Max. Well deserved. Weak. Also, I want to make it clear that I am not a fan of Taylor Swift Light. The only song I liked from her newest album is the one with the music video I am currently ripping off. And I give Apple all the credit. 92% of this album is junk. And what do we do with junk? We throw it away, of course. Wrong. Have you guys been paying attention? We throw it at the viewer. Ugh. Who chose that graphic? 15 Pro. Action. 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 Three, two, one. Action. Who says her music won't kill? Let's see. Ooh, did it kill? It actually killed! <laughs> okay, playing with it a bit more, you can still hear the recording sounds coming out of it. So there's a good chance we could still get that clip when it uploads to iCloud. <laughs> Will her music kill again? 15 Pro Max. Come on, I want a clean slice. Action. Action. Three, two, one. Action. We have a casualty, but do we have another? No, we don't! Yes! Despite hitting it multiple times, all that happened was it lost a bit more glass, but everything else seems to be fully functional. He must be a really big fan of this. At least they're both matching now. Do I even need to say who gets the point? It's the one that's been mopping the floor this entire competition. Okay, to be honest, from what I've seen online, I expected the 15 Pro to be stronger than the 15 Pro Max, but from my testing, it is obviously not the case. You should still get a case no matter the iPhone, though. So for the final scene, I want some shots of the concrete ground flying at the viewer. I f***ing dare you to call it a drop test. It's not. It's f***ing cinema! I don't know if the 15 Pro can get the shot, cause right now I only have haptics to tell me if I'm recording or not, and I have to hope it uploads to iCloud before it dies. Let's see! Backside shot! Three, two, one... Let's see! Backside shot! Three, two, one... Action! Of course, still can't see anything on screen, backside, yeah, I can't tell if it's more damage like usual, but... Felt the hat tick, looks like the recording saved. And these camera lenses really want to come off. Is it still recording though? Yes, it is! Wow. Whoops. Corner shot! Three, two, one. Once again, don't know anything except... Yep, haptics still work. And we can proudly stop recording on that, but... Ooh, it's just hanging on by a thread. And finally, 
the face down shot. Three, two, one, action. Damn, did the pine needle save it? I can't tell. What about this? Was it also saved by a pine needle like all the other times he got lucky? Uh... Looks like it, yeah! No more luck around when I'm trying to get my shots! Face down shot, round two. Three, two, one, action! <gasps> Just kidding, it looks the same! And... Of course. How are these phones both, technically, still alive? You know what holiday is coming up soon, though? Happy Hollow! Are you serious? This was extra. Wait, I know what his weakness is. Maybe the durability of newer Apple products are a bit understated. Hmm, but what if I combine Halloween with another one of its weaknesses? Yep, she's gone. I'll keep this method in mind for the future. As for the other iPhone, I was gonna throw more dinnerware items at them, but I didn't want them to die too quickly. But now, I think I need more scenes. Three, two, one, action! Ooh, we get to get some more shots. Oh, I wasn't recording, but it just randomly shut off. <laughs> yes, more shots! I think I found out why it reset. Oof. Okay, when the mug took out the cellular, it also took out the Wi-Fi, so it can't sync through iCloud or AirDrop, so I had to use the USB-C cable cable to import that last clip. <gasps> Just ignore it and pretend I still don't know what USB-C is. Three, two, one, four! Let there be no more light. Damn, that was my last bolt too. Ah, uh, it's still alive. This is my last mug, so let's make it count. Well, at least the mug didn't break, but the clip somehow got corrupted, so we gotta try that again. Three, two, one, action! Damn, I didn't have slow-mo on, but the only thing that broke on this mug is this handle, but on the phone, yeah, I wish I had slow-mo on, damn it! Action! Can we still save the clip? <laughs> Damn, now all the clips it records is corrupting for some reason. Aww. So I guess there's nothing left to lose now. I don't know which is stronger. 
for the lows. And I forgot to put it on slow-mo again. Great. Great. Pretty sure that was the final blow. Damn it, I'm an idiot. Actually, oh, did you see that? Yeah, it's still alive, just the display died. Okay, this time I'm making sure slow-mo is on for this. Oh, I still feel haptics though. Three, two, one. Haptics are still happening. You hear that? I just want it to be over. Are you die? Open, I forgot to put on slow-mo. But it's still working, so we're still good. Come on, come on. Oh, I brought the screen slightly back to life with that. Mm. Ooh, I almost forgot about my patented method. I hope I'm not stabbing into the battery. Maybe this method isn't so effective after all. Maybe we just wiggle it around in there. <sighs> okay, I think the evil has been defeated. No! No! And that brought it back to life! Damn, this would be a stab proof vest. And if you're wondering where I'm stabbing, I did some research and I'm making sure I'm not stabbing the battery. Oh my god. Oh, did that do it? No! No! This is ridiculous. I stabbed it 15 times to reference the phone. Let's see. Are you... Uh, what if we just... How about now? Huh. I think that did it. I have a new method now, which is ripping the face off of my victims. You can see how close I almost stabbed the battery. <laughs> Okay, this is not a drill, this is not a drill. I swear I felt the haptic engine, but now it's not doing it anymore and the phone is heating up, so just in case. Drown! 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 Yeah! My new method! <laughs> okay, I think we're good. Uh, It's kinda obvious who lasted longer. I don't even need to see the final score. What was the main plot of this video again? Oh, right! I was making a music video and finally got enough clips. Let me quickly edit all of them together, and it's done! Let's watch! Wow. The environmental waste was worth it! Uh-oh. Mother Nature, please don't smite me! These are the most environmentally friendly iPhones I've destroyed! And you endorsed them for that reason! It's not Mother Nature. It's Tim Cook. And I do not appreciate you showing people that they can keep using obsolete iPhones. Oh, so all that environmental stuff was bullshit? Yep. Why can't you be more like MKBHD or I, Justine? Now go upgrade. <laughs> and so with that, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and 
and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay, I had to buy a new Apple product to appease Tim Cook. Of course I don't need a new iPhone, but... My Series 4 is one of the oldest Apple products I still use every day since I got it in 2018, but it's degrading. Mmm. So I got the Series 9 because the double tap feature looked interesting. Let's open her up. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Let's set her up. Fucking piece of sh**. Beautiful. Now let's try out the double tap. Come on. Where is it? It's not out yet! And it's similar to a feature in the accessibility settings available on my Series 4? I got scammed again! Apple betrayed me! Down with capitalism! I'll forgive you, Apple, and consume again if you bring back mini iPhones! Here's a little behind the scenes of how I got that thumbnail shot. Right now I'm in the garage and I'm trying to recreate the thumbnail used in the making of that music video. So that's why I'm in the car. And we have my 14 Pro recording the 15 Pro. And my Apple Watch showing me what's happening on the 14 Pro. I also have the 15 Pro Max here just to show it off in the thumbnail. And right now I am actually still recording with an iPhone. Which one? Well... When I was setting up for the first scene, I placed the iPhone 15 Pro on this slippery sloped surface and when I went to set up the other iPhone, I heard a loud bang and this was the result. <sighs> I didn't have time to repair it, but I had a second iPhone 15 Pro I was planning on returning. <sighs> no, I wasn't happy. Come on! Fucking piece of fucking shit! Fuck! Fucking finally! But since you made it all the way to the end, I have a special announcement to make. After watching the Apple M3 Mac event, I knew I didn't need to upgrade to anything they announced, until I saw the small blurb at the end of the event, and with my experience filming with my 14 Pro, I've decided to replace all my cameras with this iPhone 15 Pro. The one I accidentally broke. But I'm still keeping the 14 Pro as my main iPhone for many reasons. It's kind of funny that this was the iPhone generation I wanted to skip out on, but it's also the generation where I bought the most new iPhones. I guess he got what he wanted. I also bought this 15 Pro Max from my friend who was in the iPhone 15 line vlog, because it was sold out everywhere at the time and he preferred the regular Pro. So this clip became a reality. Let's see if Jerry rig everything was right! <laughs> hey. Funny! Just like when I took my damaged 15 Pro to get repaired at an Apple store and the employees questioned my wallpaper. How dare you question your god? He made me remember where I came from. Okay, I would plug them in to make sure they're completely dead, but the problem is... I don't have the means to... Maybe I can fix its disfigured port by making it compatible with iPhone cables again. It's worth a shot. There! Perfect! <sighs> it worked! Ah! The report's about it overheating while charging was right! At least they made it more repairable, so we avoided another one of these!